What is the best Lunchable? Uh, it depends so much. I mean, some of my favorites, you've got the OG pizza one. Uh-huh. That's what I loved growing up. You've also got the nacho cheese salsa chip one. Mm, I had some real good salsa and, and uh, nachos over the weekend. Oh, it's oh good. yeah. And then uh, you also have the one that has like the crackers, the ham, and the cheese. Yeah, those are the classics, right? Some of my favorites. I don't know if there's any other ones, but those are the only ones that I ever I, liked. I believe they have some that have like chicken nuggets in them. Really? Yeah. Like oh. actual chicken nuggets. I don't know how those taste. I don't know how. See, for me, I was big on the pizza one, but the pizza one shines the brightest when you have a microwave involved. Oh, not cold, you're saying? Yeah, I mean, it's still okay cold, but there's nothing quite like the microwavable. Uh, the pizza, you microwave it, melt up the cheese a little bit, maybe even toast that pepperoni a little bit, get a little crisped up. That's the way I like it. That was my favorite Lunchable. But that's not a true Lunchable, though. You don't think so? No, because you would have to take a Lunchable to school. That was yeah, the point of a Lunchable. Right. And then there was there was no microwaving at school. That's what yeah. made it so great. Because you could just eat it how it was. Which I intend to change when they elect me to school board. One of my top things is going to be put microwaves for kids. <laughs> yeah. I think they should be able to have them. I don't think that's too big of a deal. But uh, the, the Lunchables, they're about to experience a little bit of a change. Uh, Lunchables announced... That starting this month in some stores and certainly by next year, the company that makes Lunchables, Kraft Heinz, is going to be putting out some new variations of their classic Lunchables. Variations that include fruit instead of the little chocolate bar. I thought you liked fruit. I like fruit. You love clementines. Clementines, one of the fruits they're putting in there. Yeah, but I'm an adult. Uh huh. I'm not going to eat a lunchable yet again because I'm an, ad an adult. Uh huh. But as a child, like a nine year old, if you're like between, do I get the lunchable with the fruit? Uh huh. Or do I get the lunchable with the crunch bar? Which one do you think I want? Yeah, but of the course. The chocolate. Of course, when you're a child, but you don't buy your own lunchables when you're a kid. It's your mom. She's exactly. in charge. She does the grocery shopping. And so, so when she buys you the ham and cheese and apple slice Lunchable. Just know your mom doesn't uh, like you very much. <laughs> That's what you need to know. But yeah, I mean, you got to have healthier options, you know? But I feel like if you're doing Lunchables anyway, uh -huh. Lunchables are a low. That's like a, a low uh, calorie uh, option anyway, right? Yeah. Uh, I mean, it's 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 got some some decent decent health benefits, I would think. Between you got crackers, they're not bad for you, right? You got you got ham, ham that's got a lot of protein, right? Meat, uh huh, uh, or turkey, which is very lean meat, Turkey's lean protein, lean. uh huh. And then you add in here the vitamins and nutrients that come from apples, grapes, pineapple, or clementines. We'll get that out of here. X nay what, that. What is a crunch bar adding to your, your tr nutritional value or Oreo cookies? Happiness, Hudson. Happiness. When you go to school uh, and you and you pop out your lunchable, you're like in second grade, and then your best friend next to you pops out his lunchable. That's not your best friend, your worst nightmare. The kid who's been bullying you. <laughs> he pulls out a lunchable and you pull out the fresh grapes uh -huh. and he pulls out the Oreo or the crunch bar. How do you think little Johnny's gonna feel? Not very good. Yeah, but not I mean, only does is he kicking your butt, he's also has has the chocolate. You got to keep in mind though that uh, sometimes what kids want is stupid. You know that. Oh, I know that. You got to say no to kids. You got to say no, Johnny. You don't get the Crunch Bar. You get pineapple. But in the long run, how much is it really making a difference? <laughs> it's like the tiniest little mini Crunch Bar of all time. Versus what, four grapes? Is that the trade-off? Do we do the crunch bar or four grapes? I mean, come on. Wasn't that a great riot clip? While you're here, you should watch more of our videos and subscribe so you don't miss what we do next.